Good morning. Um, it is uh, Georgia, Florida week, and uh, Georgia had an off week last week, so we don't have anybody to talk about uh, the game or anybody who won. The winners were the Braves, so let's just start off by saying that, that, uh, you know, what a what a season for them. And now starting today, Tuesday, they play in the World Series. Really excited for that. Um, I think it's great. I hope the Braves win. But make no mistake, I'm a Dogs fan first, and um, I'm going to remain focused on this game. So one of the things I do want to say is, as a guy that grew up in South Georgia and Valdosta, this game was a little bigger than Georgia Tech or Auburn. You know, I grew up with with people I knew that in the 90s, they sort of jumped on the bandwagon of Florida or Florida State. I mean, you get to be a fan of who you want to be a fan of. But it was frustrating to have people come to school in their FSU or their Florida Gator shirt who just decided they wanted to be a Florida fan because they were winning. And as a dog fan, it was uh, the 90s weren't great. There were a few years, but it was a tough decade. So it feels really good right now. But I'm also really nervous about the George Florida game. So, um, you know, enjoy Jacksonville. I'm not going down. I have a feeling you better enjoy it while you can. With Oklahoma and Texas coming to the league, uh, the SEC, you're probably going to see this game go away. That's frustrating to someone who understands that a lot of people in that area of the state uh, get to go to this game a little easier than coming to Athens. I think the Jacksonville uh, site was started kind of for recruiting. I think uh, before television, it was a way to take the Bulldog show on the road and get closer to some people in another part of the state. And now they're talking about taking it away because of recruiting. But anyway, back to the game. I will make my prediction. As I've already alluded to, I'm nervous. Um, you know, I can already feel the fan base feeling a little co too confident, national media talking. I've seen this game as a fan for years. Florida has had games where they felt really confident and lost. Uh, 2007, 2012, 1997. Georgia in 2002 was undefeated, came down with a very good football team, made a better football team in Florida, and managed to lose that game. Um, so I have a lot of not so much confidence as a Georgia fan because I, I just know that it's very hard to go undefeated. You have a rivalry game, a team with their back against the wall that has a capable offense. So we'll find out this Saturday how legit Georgia's team really is. I'm going to go ahead and predict a high-scoring game, 38-35 Georgia, uh, taking down the Florida Gators in a nail-biter down in Jacksonville. So uh, always remember, you know, Gators eat boogers. We're not Gators fans. Uh, sorry to any clients. We still love you, but not this week. And uh, go Braves. Big week for them. I'm going to remain focused on Georgia 38-35. Let's go, dogs. Enjoy Jacksonville, White King.